could happen under under an umbrella tree. Sunny days of thunder, your friends are waiting under under the umbrella tree. So come on, everybody, see you up at Holly's. There's no better place to be. In your imagination, you'll find an invitation under the umbrella tree. Oh, great. It grows right here by the barn. I was looking for that. Jacob, did you look under your bed? Yeah, and look what I found. Huh, my bathing suit. Your bathing suit? <laughs> that won't keep your hands warm. Ah, that's right. <laughs> A bathing suit is one thing you don't need when you're going skating. <laughs> no. <laughs> I need my red mitts. Well, Jacob, you must have had them when you went skating the other day. What did you do when you came in? Oh, well, I went to the kitchen for a snack. Uh, Maybe that's where they are. I'll go look. <sighs> oh! Oh! A pencil. <sighs> How's the puzzle going? Great! We're nearly finished. It's bigger than we thought. Yeah, it's hard to find enough room on the table for it. Mm -hmm. Well, maybe you should put some of those other toys away. Hooray! Ha! I didn't find my red mitts, but my blue mitts were in the kitchen. Under the counter. Yay! Hooray! Great! Yeah. But yeah. what about your red mitts? Oh, well, I guess they've just disappeared. Hey, you've almost finished the puzzle. Woohoo! Uh-huh. Yeah. Only one more piece to go. Right. Put it in, Gloria. Mm -hmm. You've got it, Iggy. I don't have it. Uh-oh. Oh, it's lost. Oh. Well, now, it must be oh, here somewhere. No. I Drives hope so. It's Mitzi's puzzle. I can't give it back to her with one piece missing. Oh. No, well, I'd like to help, but... I have to get ready to go skating. See ya. Hello! Hi, Mrs. McMurtry. Come on in, Mrs. McMurtry. Are you all set for your trip? Oh, I certainly am. I can hardly wait to get down there and boogie. <laughs> boogie? I think it's a kind of dance, dear. They say you're supposed to go to the beach every day and boogie every night. It sounds wonderful, Mrs. McMurtry. Are those the keys to your apartment? Yes, dear. Thanks so much for looking after my fish and my plants while I'm gone. No problem. I'll put the keys right here on the table. Now, do I have my airplane ticket? Oh, here it is. Ooh, may we see it, please? Certainly. Holly, dear, would you mind showing it to them? Not at all. See? This tells Mrs. McMurtry what plane she's taking and when it's leaving. Wow, neat. Flying in an airplane must be really fun. Oh, yes, it is. Now, Goldie needs to be fed once every day just a little pinch of fish food. Just a little pinch. I better write this down. Um, oh, dear. Uh, has anyone seen a pen or a pencil? I see one. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. <laughs> so do I. Well, what's so funny? Do you see a pencil or don't you? <laughs> it's on your ear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so it is. Okay, now I don't see any paper. Oh, well, um, anyway, uh, feed the fish once a day and water the plants. Once a week should be fine. Once a week. Okay, Mrs. McMurtry, you have a wonderful trip. Thank you, dear. Oh, I'm so excited. Bye. 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 Send us a postcard. Have fun. Wait a minute. Um, am I forgetting something? Oh, your airplane ticket. Oh, can't forget that. Here you are. Thank you. I'll put it in my purse. As I always say, a place for everything and everything in its place. I'll walk downstairs with you, Mrs. M. Can I carry anything? Oh, no, thank you, dear. I have my purse and my camera and my suitcase is downstairs. Did I give you my keys, Holly, dear? Oh, yes, they're right there on the telephone table. Okay, let's go. Bye! Have a nice trip. Bye, Mrs. McMurtry. Have fun. Oh, have a good skate, Jacob. Oh, thanks. Well, time for me to get ready to go to the lizard club. But what about the puzzle? Well, it's all done except for that last piece. But I have to find it. I can't give Mitzi's puzzle back to her like this. Well, uh, I'll help you when I get back. The sale starts at 2 o'clock. What sale? Oh, the lizard club is having a sale to raise money to paint the clubhouse. I know. Maybe it's in my burrow. Holly, have you seen my other black sock like this one? 
Oh no, have you lost another sock? No, no, I think it's the same sock I lost last time. Uh, well, I could check in the bathroom for you. Could you please look for the puzzle piece while you're there, Holly? In the bathroom? Well, you never know. Why don't you put away all these toys and things? You know, I bet the puzzle piece is somewhere underneath all of this. Yeah. Chances are maybe your sock is too. Hey, maybe it is. <laughs> I'll have a look. I'll look in my burrow. For my sock? <laughs> no, for the puzzle piece. But I'll look for your sock too, just in case. Thanks. I'll look in the bathroom. Oh, where is that sock? Where is that puzzle piece? I can't find anything around here. I said, oh, there's Mrs. McMurtry's keys. Ha, I better put them in a safe place. Ah, I know. The drawer in Holly's desk. Ha <laughs> ha, that's a good idea. There, that's a safe place. Iggy, I don't think your sock is in the bathroom. I don't know where else to look. Oh, that's okay, Holly. It's time for me to go anyway. Well, what will you wear? I'll wear one black sock, one brown sock. If I keep smiling, no one will notice. Did you see the puzzle piece there, Holly? Not in the bathroom, Gloria. I could look under my bed. Good idea, and I'll look under my bed. Okay. I guess we could put away all those toys. Aw, couldn't we wait until after the sale? If I don't go now, I'll miss it. Okay, have fun. Oh, what did I do with my blue mitts? I thought I had them on, but, well, maybe I didn't. Maybe I left them up here somewhere. What are you doing here? I thought you went skating. Oh, well, I can't find my mitts. Hey, any mail for me? Well, I don't think so. No, it's all for Holly. Yeah. Well, don't lose it. Put it in a safe place. Okay. Good. Okay, I'll see you later. Yeah, bye. Bye-bye. Oh, a safe place. What's a really safe place for the mail? Um... I know. I'll put it in the fridge. It'll never get lost in the fridge. Yeah, that's it. Uh, oh, hey, look at that. <laughs> a, a black sock. Yeah, in the fridge. Ooh, it must be Iggy's. wonder what it's been doing in the fridge. I better put it under his pillow. Yeah. Hey, now there's the pad of paper that... Holly wanted to write on. Huh, should be on her desk. Hey, look what's underneath it. Whew, the puzzle piece that Gloria was looking for. It's a picture of a mouse. There, ha, I'll just put it with the other animals. And I'll put this pad of paper in the drawer of Holly's desk. Yeah. Ha, there. Now, everything's organized, but where are my mitts? Hi, Jacob. Oh. Why aren't you skating? I can't find my mitts, Gloria. Oh, no, not your blue ones. The ones you were just wearing? Yeah, by the time I got downstairs with Mrs. McMurtry, my mitts had just disappeared. Jacob, what are we going to do about you and your mitts? You're always losing them. And what are we going to do about me and my missing puzzle piece? Oh, it's not in my room, Gloria. Oh, what am I going to say to Mitzi? Um, was it a picture of a little mouse? Yes, at least I think so. Did you see it? Yes, just a minute ago. Where is it? Well, now, just a minute, let me think. Um, Iggy's sock was uh -huh. in the fridge. Yeah. Iggy's sock was in the fridge? Yes, so I took it out and then I was about to... But, but what about the puzzle piece? Well, okay, now let's look around. Let's think to ourselves, where would Jacob put a puzzle piece? Somewhere oh. silly, I bet. Oh, I'm sorry, Gloria. I just can't remember. Oh, no. Hold it. Hold huh? everything. What's wrong? Something else is missing. Mrs. McMurtry's keys. Mrs. McMurtry's keys? You put them on the telephone table, didn't you? Yes, but they're not here now. Well, well, I didn't do anything with Mrs. McMurtry's keys. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. What will happen if, if we can't find them? Well, we won't be able to water her plants or feed her fish. Oh. Poor Goldie. Oh, Goldie will be really hungry. What are we going to do? Why do we keep losing everything? Because we're not putting things away when we're finished with them and we're not putting them in the right places. Exactly. Iggy shouldn't keep his other sock in the fridge. How did you come to be looking in the fridge? Oh, well, I opened the fridge door, put the mail in, and there it was. You put the mail in the fridge?
Peggy said to put it in a safe place. Now this is just the sort of thing that's mixing us up. But the fridge is a safe place. This is a safe place, Jacob, but it's not the right place. Remember what Mrs. McMurtry said? Uh-huh. She said she was going to boogie every night. No, no, I mean about places for things. Hmm. A place for everything and everything in its place. That's what she said. That's hmm. what we need. What? We need to decide where to put things, a place we all agree on. Oh, and put them there. And if we all put things in the same place every time, they won't get lost. Right. We might even find stuff. Ha! Huh. Like my mitts. And the piece of Mitzi's puzzle. Oh. And Mrs. McMurtry's keys. Oh. Let's try it. Right now? Mm -hmm. Sure. What are you going to do? You'll see. Hello? Oh, hello, Holly, dear. Hello, Mrs. McMurtry. I'm here at the airport. Oh, did you miss your plane? Oh, no, of course not. I still have lots of time. And I don't think I've forgotten anything. Oh, well, that's great. Listen, Mrs. McMurtry, I, I know you're going to have a wonderful time, but, but there's just one little thing. You know, there's just one thing worrying me. What's that? Did I remember to give you the keys to my apartment? Uh, well, you did give them to me, Mrs. McMurtry. Oh, good. I keep thinking about my plants and little Goldie. <laughs> Would you like my number at the hotel? Uh, yes, actually, that's probably a good idea, Mrs. M. Okay, I've got a pencil here, and just let me get, uh, paper. I've got some paper. And your keys! They're here! Hooray! I beg your pardon, dear? Did you say hurry? Hurry? Oh, uh, yes, hurry. You don't want to miss your plane. Oh, I certainly don't. Now, here's the number, dear. Okay, uh-huh. Got it. Yes. Okay, Mrs. McMurtry, you don't, don't worry about a thing. Have a wonderful trip. Okay, bye. Hooray! What? Oh, you found the oh, keys. Yes. Where were they? They were in the desk drawer under this pad of paper. Huh. How did they get there? I don't know, but I'm going to hang them up right away. Oh. Bye. Hey, this place looks great. Mrs. McMurtry's keys are going on this hook, the official key hook. Well, that's a good idea. I thought they might fall off the telephone table, so I put them in your desk drawer. Oh. What? What'd I say? I found your other black sock egg. It was in the fridge. In the fridge? <laughs> How can a sock get into the fridge? <laughs> Maybe it walked. Yeah, <laughs> or hopped. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I've solved the problem of the missing black sock. Really? How? Are you going to have a place for your socks and always keep them there? No. Well, that's what I'm going to do with my mitts. Look, there. <laughs> I tied them together with string, ran the string through my sleeves, and there they are. That's a great idea, Jacob. Uh, right, but it wouldn't work for socks. Huh? Nope. You'd have trouble walking if you tied your socks together. Yeah, I oh, sure yeah. would. No, Gloria, the answer to all my sock problems is in this bag. What's in the bag? Have a look. You bought another black sock? At the Lizard Club sale? No, I didn't buy another black sock. What? I bought a hundred black socks. Oh! <laughs> look at There's all. enough for everybody. These oh, should last you about a week. We can wear them as hats.